Initial pressures, let it be say P, temperature T, vol volume is V. Monoatomic ideal gas. So let this be an adiabatic cylinder. So there's a piston of mass in. So the, the, this is a non-conducting piston, you can write it. So initially it is in equilibrium. I slightly displace the piston at least, find the time period of oscillations. Find the find the time period of oscillations of the piston when it is slightly push it down and the lift. Okay, there, there's a basic idea. Okay, now no, no, you see that this piston I slightly displaced, I displaced it by distance y and released. We have to find out the time period of oscillations of it. Okay, let, let's see what changes. First, initially it's equilibrium, no? What are the forces that are acting? P naught E, the weight mg, the pressure force P into E. So let's go for the pressure. Anything will happen, pressure. Initially, we can say P equal to P naught A plus P naught plus MG by, I think already we know it. Now I'm going to press it. I myself, I'll, I'll push it down and release. So then the pressure here, definitely what happened will become P dash. And as this patient is conducting, let the gas undergo isothermal process. So then the temperature remains constant. The volume is going to change. So what are the forces that will be acting here? P dash A, MG, P naught A, and, and it will accelerate. We have to find out the time period of oscillations of this piston. Okay, how to bring this? So initially we'll go for it. P A, minus P naught A minus MG equal to zero. There, there's an initial thing. So finally, what, what you can see, P dash A minus P naught A minus MG equal to equal to MA. Will I agree this? Uh, why that M? Because the net force on it will be upward. So be, 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 because of that weapon, P dash A minus P naught A minus MG equal to A. Uh, no, no, let's do one thing. What is P naught A minus MG? You can write it here. So there's everything. Shall I bring it? So P dash minus P into A equal to MA. What is P dash minus P will be DP. What is DP here, the change in pressure? So let, let me get into what process the gas will undergo, isothermal process. How do you can say, let, let me give that one. Time period of oscillation piston, when it's slightly pushed down and lift, assume that <coughs> temperature of gas remains constant. Okay, we'll, we'll see ourselves huh? isothermal process. In isothermal process, we have some basic picture, no? PV equal to NRT. PDV plus VDP equal to NRDT. For isothermal process, what will happen to DT? DT will be zero. DT will be zero. 
so therefore this will become pdv plus vdp equal to zero so therefore dp what you can write it as pdv by v so dp is equal to minus pdv by v that much i can replace here this is equation one this is equation two put two in one so then this will become uh, in place of this one dp so what we can write it as a into minus p dv by v equal to me now what is p uh, already we have some information okay let me have that one uh, what is dv a into y or a into dy let me write no problem and this is v v is initial volume p is initial pressure so this will become minus p a square v dy equal to m or acceleration is equal to minus p a square m v dy okay see y or dy both are same change in volume let me let me write a y huh? that is available i'll write it what is dv change in volume i think you can notice very clearly Okay, then comparing this with standard equation of SHM, the time period is given by. Okay, now now we have to be very careful. What is that P? That is initial pressure. The initial pressure what we have that we have to substitute. And what is V? The initial volume of gas. So what are the P is equal to what is P equal to P naught plus m g by a. What is V? Initial volume of gas. What is A? Area of cross section of piston. I think. Uh, area of cross section of cylinder or piston, both are same. Uh, some very very uh, important things are there here. So the problem is not just over. Who will execute S H M? Gas or piston? The piston. So the question is no. Find the time period of oscillations of the piston. Find the time period of oscillations of the piston when it slightly pushed down and released. Okay, this one. So what is the P? P naught plus mg by. Instead of writing, let me write it here only. What is V? Initial volume of the gas. No. Sir, uh, how you can say isothermal? On what basis? It can be adiabatic also. If the time period is very less, the gas will undergo adiabatic process. If the time period is more, then it will be isothermal. Very very important. Later chapters, I'm going to take help of this problem. This numerical is going to help us a lot in one of the chapters. If this piston vibrates rigorously, what do you mean by rigorously? It takes less time <coughs> to complete one oscillation. Rigorous. Your language should be very good. If the piston vibrates rigorously, then if it takes less time to complete one oscillation, then the process will become adiabatic. You need not to make it conducting or whatever be that one. If the piston vibrates slowly or time period is more, then it'll be isothermal. Then it'll be isothermal. In respect to of whether the container is conducting or non-conducting. This idea. So in most of the cases, the piston will be conducting or cylinder will be conducting. It is in fact like how the piston moves that will determine what process the gas will undergo. So I'll, I'll write. You know, maybe they'll ask you in more than one option. So if it is like this, uh, if piston vibrates more rigorously. then the process will be adiabatic if piston vibrates slowly or gradually then the process
بالبيع يتفتر بقى اوكي فاين so this is the uh, more than on options they may test you so you be careful about this condition the problem is uh, like this we have to make some observation okay i think uh, we will we'll discuss one more problem related to this sir ah Sir, in the last question, you told that uh, piston is only slightly displaced, sir. Slightly in the sense, see, like uh, I think uh, you should be very good in your language. Ah, huh? what do you mean by slightly? I just press it and release. No, if if it vibrates very fast, see, like uh, the how you display that will not determine. Ah, huh? okay, sir. i think simply you just press it no you 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 press it because the time period is independent of amplitude of oscillation am i right will the time period depends upon y no not there okay i think uh, so some of you are okay this this uh, I'll, i'll change it uh, let it be hmm. i i made some changes so dv is equal to A Y it is. Hmm? And now I think, uh, what do you mean by slightly? Slightly means for for small value. Y will be very small that one. Then it's going to execute S H M. So how the piston moves that will determine what process the gas will undergo. So will determine the time period. I think it depends on these quantities. You see, mass of the piston, initial volume, the pressure. These quantities will determine. So if this time period is less, isothermal time period is time period is less adiabatic. Time period is more, it will be adiabatic. So if it is more isothermal, less it will be adiabatic, rigorously adiabatic, slowly or gradually, then it will be isothermal. 